Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. If your dream is to become a data analyst or a data scientist, then cracking the SQL interview is a very important stage for attaining your dream. Myself, MLU Prasad. I'm a mentor for data science and analytics. I can help you overcome this obstacle by explaining all the various questions asked in the top companies, which are already available at the LeetCode platform. All my code solutions for the questions available in LeetCode platform are there in my GitHub repository. The link for that is available in the chart description below. In addition to that, I have also segregated the channel into five playlists, namely easy, medium and hard depending upon the question difficulty which is asked in the LeetCode platform. The premium level subscription questions of LeetCode as premium playlist and I have combined all the 230 questions into one single playlist, namely as all SQL playlist ordered by the sequence number. Let's see the question which we are trying to solve it today. It is type medium question number 1341 movie ratings. Let's see the question. Okay. They are given three tables movies which is consisting of movie ID title. Okay, movie ID is the primary thing. Similarly, users, user ID name, user ID is the primary thing. Similarly, movie ratings. Okay, what are the movies? And if your user has rated any movie for that, they respect to ratings. The combination of movie ID and okay. Now what they are asking? Write an SQL query to find two things. Find the name of the user who has the greatest number of movies in case of a tie. Return the lexicographically smaller username. Okay. Find the movie name with the highest average rating in 2020 in case of return. Lexicographically smaller movie means in the ascending order of name they are asking. Okay. They have given some sample tables. Let's see it. Let's see the output also. If you see, they have asked two conditions. This is the result of first condition. This is the result of second condition. And they joined them using union. Let's see the first one. What is the first one they are asking? Find the name of the user who has rated the greatest number of movies. In case of a tie, return the lexicographically smaller number. Let's see. This is the person who is there, Daniel, user ID 1, Monica, user ID 2, Maria, user ID 3, James 4. Let's see how many movies they have rated. Okay, user ID is this one, okay. One has rated a movie, okay. One has rated this movie, okay. Similarly, two has rated this movie. Three has rated this movie. Four has rated this movie, okay. Similarly, one has rated this one. Two has rated this one. 3 has written this one, 1 has written one more, and 2 has written one more. Okay. If you see here, user ID 1 has rated 1, 2, 3, 3 movies. 2 has rated how many? 2 has rated 1, 2, yeah, 3 movies. 3 has rated how many movies? Yeah, two movies. Four has rated how many movies? Only one. If you see among them, these two are highest. But they said that if two things are same again, in case of a tie, return the smallest username. Means you need to order by ascending order. D M. D comes before M. So Daniel will be taken. One comma three. That is the first one answer. Let's solve the first one first from we need to join these two tables right only matching things we want so i will keep inner join from users table a inner join movie rating b 
B on A dot user ID equal to B dot user ID okay now we joined both these things now what we need to do for each user ID and name we need to count the number of rows so that we will get it group by let's say U dot user ID comma A dot name let's select the same thing comma A dot name and we need to do what count of rows as let's see it's called something something CT okay here you can see 1 Daniel 3 2 to Monica 3 2 2 4 1 just as we got 1 3 3 2 1 now what we want only the top one so I will order by the CT descending and if it is matching it should be name ascending okay now what we want only one row so in a my SQL you will be keeping a limit one here you will be keeping top one see we got the rows one Daniel comma three something right now let's keep this one okay instead of CT we can directly keep count here and let's remove this column because it is not required okay you got it Danny okay let's remove this also because name is only required so now we got the thing called name okay the first thing is done let's call it some CT Now let's see the second question what they're asking find the movie name with the highest average rating in February 2020 in case of tie okay let's see now let's remove this first one is solved we got Daniel now the second part is only movies which are there in February 2020 they're asking February 2020 so this movie is not there Again, what is there? The second movie is the third movie. Again, this movie is not there. This is also not there. Okay. Only six rows are there. What are the movies which are there? Here you can see one one movie. Here you can see two two movie. Here you can see three three movie. What is the average? Let's say we grouped by movie and let's see the average. What is the uh, average rating of this? Four comma two. It is three. What is the average of this one? 5 2 3.5 3 3 again 3.5 okay let's say that we grouped by movie ID after filtering out we got the ratings movie 1 3 movie 2 3 now let's see which movie we got which thing let's see we have joined these two things then what we will get Avenger got 3 Frozen 2 got 3.5 this also got 3.5 now what we need to do there are two types means among them which is having alphabetical lower F uh, if you see A B C D E F F comes now after G H I J right so F comes before so we have taken the frozen 2 see let's see this one also from let's join these two tables which table movies as a inner join movie rating table as b on a dot what is the common column movie id equal to b dot movie id okay we have joined these two tables but what we want only this only the columns which is having February 2020 February 2 or simply we can do three things by matching year equal to 2020 month equal to 2 or simply we can keep left of this column 
how many letters are there? 7. This comma 7 equal to 20, 20, 0, 2. I will write where left of where is this column? Yeah, B dot created at the first seven digits literals of this created at should be 2020 2020 02. Okay, now we got it. We have joined these two tables, filter it out. Now what we need to do? We need to group by movie, means movie and title, and we need to see, or we can directly group by title because they are both joined. We can directly we need to group by title and we need to count the rows. Let's count it. Group by A dot title. Select a dot title and count the rows. Let's call it some CT only. Let's see the answer for this. Here you can see uh, what is the thing we okay. We, we don't want count, we want average. Sorry, average, right? We are calculating the average of rating. My bad. Ratings as AG. Okay, it should be rating. Here I can see Avengers 3. Okay, average whenever you are trying to do, we will need to multiply by 1.0 so that decimal point numbers will be shown. What is this happening? I think inside this we need to do 1.0 into Okay, yeah. Here you can see now 3, 3.5, 3.5. But what we want in the order by ratings descending we want. Whenever it is matching, we still want what? Title in ascending order. Sorry, yeah, ascending order we want. But we want all the rows? No, only the top one row we want. So I will keep top one. Sorry, order not by rating, sorry. This average of rating. See, we got frozen to 3.5. We don't need this. See, we got frozen to. Now what they have done, previously we got one solution, second wall we got one solution. They are joining them horizontally. So I will keep, let's remove this CT. This is the solution to first one. This is the solution to second one. We need to join these two rows, right? So I will keep bracket. This is first thing. Union. Again bracket. This is one table. This is one table. We are joining them using union. Let's run it. Okay, let's see what is the mistake we are getting. Uh, incorrect near the keyword order by average of 1.0 into rating descending and okay, 
let's let's see it again what is the mistake you got okay age is right We're getting to it. Okay, let's keep these names alias names result. Similarly, results. Let's remove this CT. Okay. Let's write it after this. Mm, what is the mistake we are getting? copy the same thing into SQL Let me see. Okay, I have done some changes. Same thing. We need to keep them in one bracket. Union. Second table in one bracket. Instead of left, I'm trying using month. So it is coming now. Using left, you don't know why some error is coming. Now I've done the same thing. Let's submit it. Okay, keep union all then. The distinct uh, element option will be gone. Okay. Thanks for watching my video. If you want more detailed explanations like this, please subscribe to my channel. And if you have any friends who are preparing for the data analyst or a data scientist interview, just refer these videos to them. It will be helpful them for uh, cracking their interviews. Just be disciplined. Complete all the 230 questions which are there in their platform one day you'll be cracking that uh, interview with flying colors thanks